happened yesterday, we're going to be dropping two eggs, one on the grass and one on the concrete. The one dropped on the grass, we'll call that one egg number one, it will survive because the impulse is exerted over a very long time. But the one dropped on the concrete won't survive. Why? Because it goes to rest immediately. And so, the, since the impulse is spread out over a very short time, force skyrockets, and that breaks the egg. So, now, let's Let's look at our five possible suspects and eliminate a few of them. I don't think it could be mass. Why? Well, because the two eggs are identical. There's no way mass can affect them. They have the same mass, after all. And while we're at it, we can also cross off velocity. Why? Because they took the same time to fall and they had the same acceleration. Since V equal A T, then that made the velocity for them were the same. Now, let's look at our three remaining suspects, momentum, force, and impulse. I don't think momentum could fit, because since mass and velocity are the same, and since P, momentum, is mv, or mass times velocity, then they have to be the same too. So we only have two suspects, force and impulse. All right. Now, I'm going to go to the police precinct and see what they have to say. All right, so here's what happened at the police precinct. At 2 p.m., I arrived there. It's a pretty short ride, but still uh, sort of long. Anyways, I came up to the policeman just standing there and asked him, Who killed my egg? And then... He said, do you have any suspects? He said, that makes our job a lot easier. And then I said, yeah, I do have only two suspects. You're in luck. I have only force and impulse. Then he asked me, what are their names again? Force and impulse. And then he asked, is that the first name or the last name? And then I said, they don't have first names or last names. Then he said, weird. But nowadays, he said, criminals use very weird names. Don't worry, Professor Isaac. We will find who killed your egg. And then I said, all right. Then I had to wait for three hours. Three whole hours. And then it five ten he came up to me again and he said what was your problem again who broke your windshield and then i said no i said who killed my egg and then he says all right we will find who killed your egg then, I waited for two more hours without results. Finally, at 7.10, he came up to me and said, What was your issue again? Who stole your car? And then I said, No! I said, Who killed my egg? Force or impulse? And he said, All right, I will call the police commissioner. I will call the FBI director, I will call the CIA director, and I will alert every single airport in the United States to not let force or impulse in, so force and impulse can never leave the country. Then I said, what an idiot. And I just straight up walked out and left.